Hi dears, welcome back again with another delicious recipe, Rava Kesari and some tips to get a perfect Kesari. Make your specialty even more special with this recipe. Please follow the same quantity of ingredients and same steps to make the perfect Rava Kesari. Ingredients are below the description box. Hope you'll enjoy it. Keep watching. First, set the all ingredients. Crush 6 to 8 cardamoms and some cashews and raisins. For color, in a bowl, add some saffron and 2 to 3 tablespoons hot water. It's completely optional. You can add food color instead of saffron and also you can skip the color. One cup of semolina. In the same cup, taking three fourth cup of sugar. Ingredients are ready. Let's make the kesari. In a heated pan, add 2 teaspoons ghee, add cashews and raisins and roast them till it turns light golden. Take it out. In the same pan, add 1 more teaspoon ghee and add 1 cup rava, roast it on medium flame till you get a nice aroma but color should not be changed. Once the rava is roasted, keep it aside. In another pan, adding 1 cup milk and 2 cups of water, if you don't want to add milk, then you can add total 3 cups of water. Goes in crushed cardamoms, soaked saffron and just a pinch of salt for balanced sweetness and let it boil. When the milk is boiled, add roasted rava slowly and keep stir continuously. Mix it well without any lumps. Now the rava absorb all the milk but still not cooked so keep stirring for 2 minutes. Maintain low flame throughout. Rava should be cooked well before adding the sugar because after adding the sugar rava will not get cooked. Adding 3 4 cup of sugar little at a time, mix it without any lumps. I like mild sweet taste, that's why I added 3 4 cup of sugar. You can add up to 1 and half cups of sugar as per your taste. Sugar will start melting and become watery, don't worry it will come back to normal. Now adding 2 more teaspoons ghee and roasted cashews and raisins mix it together. Keep mixing the rava and don't allow formation of any lumps it become thick again. Finally add 1 4 teaspoon rose essence for the flavor again this is also optional mix it well and our delicious rava kesari is ready to be served if you follow the tips and procedure correctly, it will be so tasty and doesn't get dry even after several hours. Mm -hmm. 
That's all for today. Hope you'll give this a try and let me know how it turned out for you. Do like and share among with your friends and families. If you haven't subscribed my channel, please don't forget to subscribe. And follow my Instagram page, link in my description below. This is Shafana. See you in another video. Until then, stay safe, stay happy. Thank you. Assalamualaikum.